Well, it was one warm, toasty day here in the Korean capital, but uh, for more on the weather details, let's head straight over to our Lee ji -hun at the Weather Center. Now, ji -hun, the beautiful spring conditions are certainly welcome, but really I cannot say the same about the fine dust levels that seem to be on the increase. Hello, Ganyang. Yes, in fact, the dust levels remained high in the metro area all day long today with stagnant air circulation. You know, Jihan, I definitely felt all the dust mm. in the air today. It seems that less than pleasant air quality comes hand in hand with milder temperatures. That's right, and tomorrow should be pretty much a repeat of the conditions we saw today, meaning the capital area will have high levels of fine dust once again, so be sure to have a mask handy tomorrow. And these are due to a lack of air circulation and the arrival of toxic dust from China. Now, temperatures will be slightly lower than uh, uh, today and uh, still above the seasonal averages here in the capital, but we'll have mostly sunny skies most of the time across the nation. So on that note, let's take a closer look at the readings for tomorrow. Daily low here in Seoul and Daegu will kick off at 4 degrees Celsius, while Busan and Jeju will kick off at 9 and 7. And as for the daily highs, Seoul will top out at 14 degrees Celsius, but very mild over in Daegu, topping out at 20 and 19 over in Busan. Now, there should be a gradual drop in temperatures this week, bringing us back to what it should be like at this time of the year. But due to relatively mild conditions we've been having lately, it could feel a little bit breezier and chillier. So be sure to dress in layers to avoid catching a cold. Now, that's Korea for you. And here's the international weather for viewers around the world.